everybody has a story. I love the community and I try to, I, I do everything in my power to empower the community. So you're seeing an incredible collection of work from Peter Singurier, just very expressive, bold colors, primarily figures of people of color, um, and you're seeing them, you know, in different perspectives as well. Honestly, it all started with my daughter. Um, the minute she came out, I think the mindset started changing where I wanted to create work that would empower her. And of course, when she gets older, I want her to be proud of the work and be proud of who she is. It's really important that we have this art here and it adds a totally different atmosphere to the Board and Common Commissioner's Chambers. All these vibrant colors and oh my goodness, and I fell in love with one of them and I think I'm going to try to buy it. She's just beautiful. I'm, I'm looking at her skin and he has pulled out all of those colors. Even though she's black, he's pulled out different colors. And then he put all the colors around it and put pink in there and a bow on her. And then he puts his signature red circle. It's just simply beautiful. Since I have been mayor here in Orange County, we have tried to make certain that we accentuate uh, the arts and cultural affairs here within our county. In the atrium, our community gallery, the artist we have right now, Stephen Taylor, is a person that likes to be out on the water with ships. The big old sail ships, all kinds of lines. This is really difficult. Watercolor, you can't go over. and uh, Whatever you put down, every little square is its own thing. When he did that intricate design of the ship, I felt a part of that. I really could relate to that. I cannot believe the opportunity that you guys give to myself and all the other people that I know that have been in here. And I'm really thankful that people get to see my stuff over there. It's important to come and experience art, but when you're doing that with other people, then there's an additional dimension of who we are as humans.